and sisters and friends, once again I am here with a word of encouragement to our brothers and sisters and friends and relations who are under lockdown now on account of the COVID-19 pandemic. Many are living in fear. Fear may kill more people than the virus itself. And we Christians have no business living in fear. Why? Because we have a Lord who even though he is silent often, he is available to help us. We have a God who will see us through this pandemic. We shall overcome. Yes, many people are getting infected, but many people are also getting healed. And why not ourselves? Should any of us get infected, we shall be healed by the power of Jesus, by whose wounds we have been healed, by whose stripes we have been made whole. Now, one of the incidents in the scriptures that is very encouraging for us when we are in trouble is that of Jesus walking on the water. And Peter, seeing Jesus walking on the water, attempting to go to him walking on the water, and be Peter began to sing. It's the passage of Matthew's Gospel, chapter 14, from verse 22 to 33. And I read, directly after this, he made the disciples go into the boat and go across to the other side, while he would send the crowds away. After sending the crowds away, he went up into the hills by himself to pray. When evening came, he was there alone, while the disciples by now, far out on the lake, they were battling with a heavy sea, for there was a head wind. In the fourth watch of the night, he went towards them, walking on the lake. And when the disciples saw him walking on the lake, they were terrified. It is a ghost, they said, and they cried out in fear. But at once, Jesus called out to them, saying, Courage! It is I. Do not be afraid. It was Peter who answered, Lord, he said, If it is you, tell me to come to you across the water. Come, Jesus said. Then Peter got out of the boat and started walking on the water towards Jesus. But as soon as he felt the force of the wind, he took fright. And he began to sink. Lord, save me! He cried. Jesus put out his hand at once and held him. Man of little faith, he said, why did you doubt? And as they got into the boat, the wind dropped and all was calm again. The men in the boat bowed down before him and said, Truly, you are the Son of God. Truly, Jesus is the Son of God. And it is the same Jesus Peter, his uh, compatriot, served. It is the same Jesus that we are serving today. And that Jesus says, come to me across the water. We shouldn't doubt. We we'll go to him and we shall overcome. Tell me to come, Lord, walking on the water. You strengthen my faith, I will ride through the sea. Tell me to come, Lord, walking on the waters. Give me your power, give me your spirit, I will ride through the sea. Tell me to come, Lord, walking on the waters. If you strengthen my faith, I will ride through the sea. Tell me to come, Lord, walking on the waters. Your power, give me your spirit, and we ride through the sea. Tell me to come, Lord, walking on the waters. If you strengthen my faith, I will ride through the sea. Tell me to come, Lord, walking on the waters. Give me your power, give me your spirit, and we ride through the sea. Make me faithful, make me faithful. I will ride through. Truly a Christian, I will ride through the sea. Make me faithful, make me faithful, I will ride through the sea. Make me faithful, oh Lord, I will ride through the sea. Oh, tell me to come, Lord, walking on the waters. If you strengthen my feet, I will ride through the sea. Tell me to come, Lord, walking on the waters. 
your power, give me your spirit. I will ride through the sea. God bless you.